USA Today released their list of the greatest NBA players of all time. And Skip's guy, Michael Jordan, came up with the number one spot. To no one's surprise, LeBron then came in at number two, followed by Kareem, Magic, and Wilt. Chris Broussard is still with us. Chris, did they get this right? They got it so right, Alex, that uh, my top five is exactly the same as their top five. Now, look, I know Shan is going to disagree, <laughs> but a lot of websites and media groups are putting out top 75 player lists now, mm -hmm. right? Or top yeah. 50, top 25th 20, whatever anniversary of the NBA, yep. I have yet to, I, yeah, I have yet to see one that doesn't have Michael Jordan at the top. And I'm willing, without knowing the list, I, I Well, the NBA probably won't even rank them when they, they do their 75, but I think Jordan, yeah, Jordan would be at the top. Jordan, nobody's had a perfect career, but I would say Jordan had the closest thing to a perfect career that we've seen in the NBA. He dominated in individual statistics and in winning. Bill Russell dominated in winning, but not individual statistics like a Jordan. Um, Jordan had no weaknesses. I, I, there's no weaknesses in his game, you know? And, and so I think Jordan's the clear number one. My top five is the same. I think the other controversial one in the top five, because I, I bet a lot of people's four are, are like they have at USA Today, is Wilt Chamberlain. And he had two rings, so he won the championships. You got to do that. But I don't think we've seen an athlete dominate a sport statistically, the way that Wilt Chamberlain did. Maybe Babe Ruth back in the day, but remember, the leagues were segregated, so Josh Gibson in the Negro Leagues, I think he could have hung with Babe Ruth to some degree, uh, but nobody hung with Wilt. He's got the four highest scoring individual seasons ever, 50 points, 44 points, 38 points, all-time leader in rebounds per game. I mean, he just, it, it was ridiculous. We all know, I call the NBA record book the biography of Wilt Chamberlain. Yeah. <laughs> He's done things that just will never be done again. The second five of this list is where I differ differ with USA Today. I've got the same players, but my order's different. So at number six, I've got Larry Bird. I mean, Larry Bird was just awesome. You know, yeah, that Boston team that he went to won 29 games his the year before he got there. And with virtually the same roster as a rookie, he led them to 61 games, <laughs> 61 wins. And then the next year, they won the championship. Uh, seven, I've got Tim Duncan. Now, I've, I've, I like Kobe's game better. I would have rather, if I was in one of their shoes, I'd rather have Kobe's career for the grace, the style. He was, he's iconic, you know, even before the tragic death. Uh, I'd rather be Kobe, but... Tim Duncan, I got to admit, you look at it objectively, I think he was better. Number eight, I got Kobe. Number nine, I have Shaq. And number 10, I've got Bill Russell. So it's the same five, but in a different order. Okay. I mean, I ain't got no problem with that. I mean, I, I can deal with that list. The only problem is when you and I going to separate, Chris, we going on the same path. We going to the <laughs> same location. But where you and I going to separate, all of a sudden that you know you, you want to go in front of me, but I need to go first, <laughs> number two. Mm. Go, James, where's that? It's a lonely path. There ain't no lonely path. Ain't no lonely path. Ain't no lonely path. <laughs> but see, what y'all done, y'all convinced yourself. You said it over and over. Jordan, go. No. Jordan, 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 Jordan. Everybody and it, thinks ain't everybody, ain't no, you. So what am I? Am I not a body? Am I not somebody? Yeah, you're a body. <laughs> like, That's about all you are. <laughs> I just, my guy's birthday is coming up this weekend. Yeah. I'm like uh, Reverend Jackson used to say, I am somebody. Mm. So with that being said, <laughs> it's hard to overlook. I believe my, uh, LeBron James is the greatest all-around basketball player that we've ever seen. His body of work, his resume, the 17 consecutive starts in the All-Star game, the 13 first-team All-NBA, the four MVP finals, the four uh, 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 league finals, second to Jordan, well, Kareem has six um, uh, regular season uh, uh, finals and, and uh, two, I think, NBA uh, or finals MVP, yeah, but it's hard to argue the consistency. I mean, we got to, I mean, it's not like he's just 19 years in and he's just coasting alone. He's still a top player. You will attest to this, Chris, no other historically great player that has played as long as LeBron James comes even close. Mm -hmm. Not Duncan, not Kareem, not Kobe, not Dirk. None of them come close 
at this stage of their career to where LeBron is. LeBron is still regarded. If not the top, people say to, uh, uh, KD, uh, Giannis, okay, fine. But LeBron is not out of the top three. Everybody believes that he's a, still a top three player in year 19. So when I accumulate, oh, when I put my arms around everything, Skip, and I got some long arm, put it around everything, mm -hmm. the only problem I got with it, one and two. <clears throat> you can leave it. I, 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 I like Chris's five, his bottom five, five through uh, uh, six through uh, five through ten. Mm -hmm. I like that. But where y'all gonna we gonna part ways? I've been parted with you. Okay, <laughs> it's finally my turn. I'm parted with you. Stop. I'm, I'm so shook up by everything I just heard. It's hard to refocus on the most glaring problem with this list. The, the disqualifying, horrifying problem with this list is who is ranked second on this list. What? What's wrong with it? LeBron James is a point guard slash two guard who is a lousy three point shooter. He's really a lousy jump shooter and he is an abominable free throw shooter. They're called free throws. In the last five seasons, four times he's been under 70%. It's embarrassing. It's disqualifying it for him to be second on this list. And this list is filled with cold-blooded basketball killers. Yeah, let's roll Give LeBron me the ball it. and get out of my way. Killers, starting with that guy at the top of the list who should be actually on a list of his own in his own universe. He doesn't even belong, Michael Jordan, on this list. He should be on another one by himself. But LeBron does not belong at two or three or four or five on this Stop list. Stop it, Skip. I, I got him at nine, and I can make a strong case. No, you should. I, oh, I, I got him nine. below Larry Bird. But let's just take the, the Laker legends, shall we? He's not better than Magic Johnson or Shaquille O'Neal or Kareem Abdul-Jabbar or especially Kobe Bean Bryant. And Shannon, you brought up, oh, he's a better three-point shooter than Kobe. Was he a better shooter than Kobe? Help me out. He's a better player a better than Kobe. Better shooter than Kobe? Better player. Let's just stop it. Player. We're talking about the closest thing to Jordan I've seen since Jordan was Kobe Bean Bryant, the late and the great. Right. And he's just better. He's more valuable. All four of those Laker legends are more valuable overall than LeBron James. No, stop it. I'm starting no, it. No, no, no. I'm sorry. No, Number no. two on this list, it's like political correctness run amok. Nah, it's going to be doing it. It's what, because what? they don't want to burn bridges to LeBron's inner circle. Yeah, inner people. circle do what? Yeah, yeah, they run pro basketball and sports in general. Okay. <laughs> I, go ahead, Chris. Go ahead, Chris. Kareem. Okay, you got Kareem, with all due respect to the great Kareem, Kareem missed the playoffs a few years in his prime, or at least once. He actually wasn't. He, he missed the playoffs once in his prime. Can we even imagine that happening to LeBron James? Yeah, it happened. We the can't first even year fathom that. And most of most of Kareem's championships, five with the Showtime Lakers, you know, the last three, obviously, Magic was kind of the leader. Of that, not to dismiss Kareem, of course, because the skyhook allowed him to score at will late into his career. But Magic ran those last few championship teams. And so I can't put that's why I put LeBron ahead of Kareem. Will, I think you've even said it yourself, at times you wondered, was the heart there, right? I when agree. Willis Reed comes out correct. of the tunnel, yes. you know, with matchups with Bill Russell. Kobe. You're right. He, Kobe was a facsimile of Jordan, but the facsimile is never quite as good. Like, Kobe wasn't that efficient of a score. LeBron's a far more efficient scorer. Both were right. great defenders, but I think overall, LeBron was a better defender. Kobe was a great individual, lock you up defender, but team defense was, had some question marks about that. So I, I just think, I, I think it's right with LeBron at number two. But I'm, I'm just, I'm just trying to figure, Skip. You, I mean, a guy that couldn't score has a higher scoring average than Iverson, Kobe, same as Kevin Durant, higher than James Harden. Who and said he, he couldn't score? You, Joe, but he not score. He's not a killer. He's he not, not a killer. killer. He's the greatest driver of basketball a, I've ever seen. But late game, he, he runs from the free throw line. He, he is the worst late game clutch free throw shooter of any superstar we've ever seen. He's the best. He's the superstar. He on there. He should Shaq. be disqualified. I mean, what about Shaq? Shaq, Tim Duncan, Bill Russell. They're seven Real feet tall. So, so, you, 
So was huh? Kareem. He's the point so guard. So was Yao Ming. Huh? Y your point guard can't shoot 65% from the free throw He ain't no point guard. He's a three. He's the greatest small uh, forward to ever live. Oh. Uh, well, that's not what I've been seeing. He dribbles the ball up the floor. Yeah, stop it. So was, was Scottie Pippen a point guard? No, he was a point forward. You know what he is. LeBron was born to play point guard. He He's was born close, to play basketball. Closest thing to Magic since Magic. I'll give you that. Hey. Skip, you got to let this go, man. All right, guys, for we are letting this nine? conversation go. We have nine? to move on. Chris, thank you so much for joining us. Moving on. Nine. Will Trey Lance get his chance to outdo Kyler Murray this weekend? Don't go anywhere.